Well, hello everyone, and welcome to another part of Call of Cthulhu. Uh, this is part 12, which comes after part 11. Because <laughs> uh, part 11 is a bit of uh, rambling together with a bit of running around, with together a bit not knowing what the heck I should do. Um, sorry for the lack of updates, as some of you might know. I've recently gotten a job. Um, and that involves me making a lot of lessons and correcting tests because now I'm officially a teacher and I need to do things. I can't play video games anymore, so it seems because I simply don't have the time. Now, I don't think Brian Burnham wants to come with us, so what we'll do is we'll show him the picture of his girlfriend. Ruth Billingham gave me this. What? This is the photograph I gave her before. before. Oh, damn. I've been so foolish. Yes, if Ruth you trusts you, Jack, then so do I. Please, hurry and get this door open. I have the keys. It's unlocked. The garage on the main street holds an old automobile. It should be able to get us clear of town. Should be able to? If we can just make it through the patrols. Lead the way, Jack. Um, there aren't any patrols, because I killed them all. Apparently, um, it wasn't the best idea. Well, the best idea. It wasn't... You weren't supposed to kill all the people around here. This is it. You were supposed to stealthily... Damn it! They're not normally locked. We'll have to find another way in. Where to now, Jack? The sewers. Um, you were supposed to sneak around, all stealth-like, and... Stuff. I just I just read that somewhere uh, on the internet. Like, oh my god, I had so much trouble doing the stealth part in Call of Cthulhu with Come Brian on, Burnham. Come on, Jack! We need to get off the streets. Shut up. I'm talking here. And I just wondered what what stealth part? There's something wrong down here. Something very wrong. Bravo, Jack. Congratulations on your new promotion to Innsmouth's enemy number one. Shut your trap, Maggie. You're not a factory inspector. Who do you work for? Okay, detective. I'll come clean. I'm an undercover agent for the United States Treasury Department. We've been working closely with the FBI on a secret investigation of Innsmouth. I'm the inside man. Really? What have you been able to find They're out? They're not paying their taxes. The Innsmouth look, Jack. It's at the heart of the problems in this town. More than half the population must be infected by now. The spreading of that contagion, or whatever the hell you want to call it, is the key. I just know it. This is all very interesting, fellas, but we've <laughs> got to get out of Innsmouth with Ruth. She's waiting for us at some old fishing cannery, just past the station to Rowley. Listen, Jack. There are some agents watching the road not far past that spot. If you can make it there, you'll be safely picked up. I need you to do something for me. You can do it while I get this thing started. When they arrested me, they took a brooch I was carrying. It belonged to Ruth. It carries her picture inside. I won't leave it behind. Are you crazy? We don't have time for this. They'll be holding it in the jail office safe. I don't know the combination. I overheard ropes talking to one of the other guards. He said something about an important date, and someone called Captain Obed Marsh. If you want to get in through the back door, just knock, and I'll open it for you. I ain't nowhere to get time for that. I guess I'll go back. Not important date, important. Did I read an important... Yes! 1846. Now we just... Oh, stop walking so slowly. Now I just need to, um... Why is he walking so slow? See, when you walk sideways, you go way faster than walking... That's weird. Now, 1846 is the date Obed, um... Oh dear. Wanted to, uh... Well, escaped from the jail. 
with the help of uh, his friends. Oh shit! What the hell? Where did all these people come from? I killed them all. Some will be for lynching. Marsh learns the prisoner is escaped. Yeah, that's for certain. Hey, fucking. Better crouch. I can't open it with that. I did it wrong. Okay, okay. I Let must me try have done something wrong. One. Eight. Four. Six. Yes. What the? Oh, okay. There was a transformed human that put it in the safe. This must be Ruth's brooch. What the hell happened? And I don't know if you saw it, but uh, it was in the form of the a doors bolted shut. Trilobite. Trilobite. I don't know what you guys call it. No, it's not time to go insane, Jack. Stop me, you are outsider. Come here. Die, outsider! Ah. Uh. Come here! Oh shit! What? Sorry for the little jump cut there. I really apologize, but I died. And, uh. Well, you don't want to see me dying all the time, do you? No, you want suspense. Action! And. Witty commentary, I guess. I heard something. Do 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 do. <laughs> Sorry, I can't do witty commentary, that's not me. If you want witty commentary, find someone funny. Brian, it's me. Open up. I'm still not done with the car yet, Jack. Here it is. Thanks, Jack. Ruth would have been heartbroken if I'd lost it. I'll be done in just a second. Hold on. It's cool. I'm finished. Get in the back. I know the way. I know one thing. This is going to be one hell of a ride. Jack, I think I saw some ammo in the back of the truck. We'll need it. Get us out of here. Hold on, Jack. To what? Whoa! Get ready, Jack. Release the young siren, Bertle. Stop them. They're coming this way. Yes, because I can see with this kind of vision. Shit! 
Get us the hell out of here now! Get him down! I'm the wrong side of the way! Back in the car! Do, 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 do. They're coming this way. Kill him. Get 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 Oh, come on, Brian. Why do you suck so hard? I know I can't drive, but I can drive better than this. Ow. Come on. I think I'm good here. Jack, you know. You better check this out. You gotta get through oh, that tunnel. Just force your way through. It's too dangerous, it's Jack. The canisters on that truck are explosive. We'll do something about that truck, Jack. Stop where you kill him now. There we go. Get him now. Get him now. Don't let him escape. They're stuck. Don't let him get away. No, we're not. Get out, Jack. The old fishing cannery is just around the corner. Hurry up. But it's swarming with the order. Just find Ruth. I'll meet you at the other side. Sure. Why not? You know, just leave me here in the middle of a freaking town with people all over me while you got a car. Genius, Burnham. Freaking genius. Search the area. <laughs> you thought you heard something, eh? I think this game does take the crown of uh, the stupidest <laughs> henchmen, enemies in video game history. You there, hold it. Stop. Don't let him escape. Take him down. Just one shot, that's ridiculous. Fine, I'll reload the video when they're really dead. <sighs> Spoke too soon, didn't I?